One week till nationals. We're here. This is nationals. I want to win it again. Nationals. 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 It's nationals. This is nationals. Did they go home national champions? Or do they go home with their tails between their legs? Not only might we not win, we might leave embarrassed. I think Abby's lost her mind. Again. This is nationals. It's all come down to this week. This is our last competition of the season. There's no more next weeks. There's no more do-overs. There's no more second chances. This is it. We have to win right here, right now. Here we are in another studio, another week. We need to learn a new group routine. This is tough. We have to do it today, and there's props. Now, I want to reflect a little bit on the past two weeks. I keep telling you guys, you have been given an amazing opportunity. You've been hand-selected to go across the country and learn a new number each week and do these competitions. And you are not stepping up to the plate. It's been a long road. The girls are tired. We're all tired. But this is when they really need to push, focus, dig down deep inside themselves, and prove that they are the champions that I have trained. I want to see energy, enthusiasm, fun. If you don't want to do it, there's probably 100 other kids that would love to be in your shoes right now. So I need to see motivation. I want you to want to win. This is my reputation on the line. It's my name. But by now, it's also your names. Everybody is in the group number this week, even Mackenzie. I'm a little scared to dance in the group number. I don't want to mess up. Every single one of you are an important part of this puzzle. And in a group routine, everybody needs to pull their weight. And I'm telling you what, we need to win. All right, let's get to rehearsing. Let's get moving. OK, ladies, the piece is called Beautiful. And what it's about is not how pretty you're going to be in your costumes, not how pretty your hair is, but what's on the inside. And it's about taking a good look in the mirror, not at what you see, but like the internal mirror. Are you getting any of this, Mackenzie? Yeah, it's a little deep for nationals. We're only doing one group number. It's called This Is My Beauty. Hold the mirror and cover your face. The girls use handheld mirrors as props for the routine. We're trying to get the message across to the judges that we believe that we're beautiful, dancing is beautiful, everybody's beautiful. Mia, I don't want to start the day out screaming at you. Think about what you're doing. Do it right. We're in Lake Tahoe at Starbound Nationals. This is when the girls decide. Do they go home national champions, or do they go home with their tails between their legs? Oh, how good it feels You better to turn be that left foot out. Beautiful. How wonderful Get that up in the air! No one's holding the mirror in front of their face. We're at nationals this week, and it's a lot of pressure. Like, a lot of pressure. Head front on the garage tank. Look right at the judges on the coupe so tank. The girls have not been winning on the road, and this is the last chance for the Abby Lee Dance Company to get that national title. Everything depends on winning here at nationals. I don't want to place. I want to win the whole thing. Judges, look at the Star Open, ages 9 and 10, number 1001. This is my beauty. really good and nailed it and I really want to get first place with that number just because I think it's a really good number. Thank you very much. One more big round of applause for every performer on this stage. <laughs> one point. One single point. Just one separates second and first place. I'm going to call both groups up here. In no particular order. This is my beauty Abby Lee Dance Company. 
Rolling in the deep, McCoy Rigby Conservatory. Now, audience, are you ready for your top junior group? Winner of a cash prize. I am too. This is my beauty Abby Lee Dance Company. Make some noise. They won the whole thing. They won the whole thing. I am so proud of the girls. This number won everything. They were the highest score in the entire competition. And nobody is ever going to forget the name Abby Lee Dance Company. You want to remind us one more time who your uh, dance teacher is? Abby Lee Dance! And what studio? Real loud. Abby Lee Dance Company! Top junior group. Thank you very much. Both of you take a bow. We won that 2011 national title. I want to win it again. Now. This week, we're gonna stay right here in sunny Los Angeles, but we are going to the most famous zip code. <gasps> no, 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 no. Sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. We are going to 90210 <laughs> Beverly Hills. <laughs> we are going to the Energy Dance National Invitational. Several competitions are doing this now, where they invite you to come to their nationals. So it's very prestigious and quite an honor to be invited. Everyone is in the group routine. And this group routine is very disturbing. And the title is My Last Text. This routine should leave the judges feeling something. This week, we're doing a group number called My Last Text. And it's really weird and scary. So here's a car seat. Okay, Maddie, get in the passenger seat right there. This number is called The Last Text. I have this vision. We're gonna put the kids in a car, even though they're really a little young to be driving. Now you're in a car. So when she turns, everybody, everybody has to lean. I'm gonna use Paige as the driver. She doesn't have to do too much. Kelly will probably hit the roof, but Paige is beautiful to look at. They're on their phones and they're taking pictures of each other. That's what little kids do. And then in the music, boom. There's a car crash on each tank. They're not hearing this. If Maddie can pull this number off with her acting skills, it's gonna win. It's gonna win everything. Paige, for God's sakes, you haven't even danced yet. Sit up straight. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. sitting outside and all of a sudden the girls burst through the door and everybody's like freaked out a little bit and they're like oh the music's really creepy and Mackenzie gets ejected from the car and I'm thinking like what the hell kind of dance is this girls I need you to focus this is nationals we came all this way and worked hard and rehearsed in crappy little studios to get to this point don't blow it right now don't be the kid that ruins the entire number I'm confident the girls are confident but you never know this is a national competition. Everybody came to win. Let's go. Please welcome to the stage, The Last Text. I'm a little afraid that something called The Last Text may be a little too bloody and gory for a national title. or dance teacher's life, those moments are few and far between. Nobody knew whether to clap or cry or what to do. That was a great moment in my life. 
We're going to move over to the Energy Junior small group. In third place, the Story Eight Count Dance Academy. Second place goes to Troop Beverly Hills. The Nationals, we won. The Ivy League Dance Company remains a force to be reckoned with. Here we are in New Orleans, Louisiana, filled with history. This week, we are the Nationals. We've worked all season for this. This is when we're going to see if the Ivy League Dance Company still has what it takes to be reigning national champions. The Wicked Witch of the West is here to beat you. The last thing we need is for Kathy to be at nationals. Every time we see her, bad things happen. You are all in the group routine. We will be performing a tribute to the hurricane victims. Eight years ago, Hurricane Katrina devastated this city. So if you're gonna be here, and you're gonna be on this team, you are going to be the absolute best that you can be. This piece called Home Again was specifically written for the Abby Lee Dance Company. And the choreography is beautiful. We have a lot of work to do if we're gonna pull this one off. Hello. Abby, I'm leaving. So I decided I'm, I'm gonna go. I'm Right before nationals? Asia's probably gonna be heartbroken because she wants to be in the group. But from the incident last night to this morning, I just... What uh, incident last night? There was a confrontation oh, between a Leslie and Christy. <laughs> I'm just not gonna sit here and play the game with them. I'd rather just go and do what we need to do mm -hmm. and take her. How could two mothers representing the Abby Lee Dance Company go out in the middle of Bourbon Street and get into a scuffle with each other. Christy, you're out. Chloe is gone for this week. Leslie, you have to take Peyton home. You're gone. I would rather take a loss at the national competition than to let these two women stay here one more minute. And now I am down three dancers. Tomorrow we are walking into a competition and nothing is gonna stop us from reaching our goals. I want to see people that are strong enough to move on and get on that stage and be 10 times better dancers than you've ever been before. Make some noise for home again. They came out strong. They looked gorgeous in the costumes. And I think the number was the best they could have done it. Moving on to our elite junior small group. I am literally shaking. My heart is beating a million miles per minute. And your highest scoring elite junior small group is act number 91. We did it. We won. The Abby Lee Dance Company was named the overall high score winning junior group. It was like this weight was lifted from my shoulders. This was very, 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 very much earned. I'm glad that we ended our season overall national champions. I mean, that's what you work for. The time has finally come for nationals. 
We are in Los Angeles, California. I wanted my kids to attend a nationals here in this city because this city is all about stars and I make stars. These kids have won three nationals in a row. I think the winds are changing. The select team, originally I brought you in to go head to head with members of my other team. It was a successful experiment. But next season, that's all going to change because I will be opening a studio in Los Angeles, California. I want to bring as many star dancers as I can with me. I know Maddie will come, but who else is going to make the cut? We will be attending intensity dance competition for nationals. I have two group routines planned. The junior elite team will be performing a contemporary lyrical piece entitled Amber Alert. The select team will be performing a routine called Hollywood Stars. It's very important that we have a good showing at this competition. The select competition team is doing a piece called Hollywood Stars. They seem to do quite well with pretty, elegant, feminine, because these girls have beautiful technique. If the select team doesn't bring it, this could be their first and last nationals with the ALDC. She is kidnapping you. She took you. And she keeps trying to get you in this chair, but she's here, right? She's gagged. The elite group routine is entitled Amber Alert. All right, ready? And try to move yourself. Try to get out of it. Get out, fight your feet, kick. It's about a little girl getting abducted right from her family. At a national level, you need to do a piece that pushes the envelope. Amber Alert could be just what my junior elites need to win. Feet are straight, legs are straight, feet are flat. Nationals are one day away. If we don't do this number the way it was intended, I don't see a fourth straight national victory in our future. Mackenzie, up, up, down, down, up, up, down, down, I gave it to you. The dance is a mess. Abby has not invested the time that she needed to into this dance. Girls, line up, let's go. 13 weeks in a row you won. Till these guys showed up. Now they're going up against each other head to head at nationals. Who is gonna come out on top? In the contemporary category, moving into number 61, it's Hollywood Star. The select team. They were beautiful. It's everything you would want your national group number to look like, unfortunately for us. Continuing on in the competition is Amber Alert. Now it's the moment of truth. Who's it gonna be? It's all in the judges' hands now. And now to acknowledge our highest scoring group routines of the entire competition. In second place, join me in congratulating act number 61, Hollywood stars from the Abbey Lee Dance Company. Your national champion, act number 63, Amber Alert from the Abbey Lee Dance Company. Congratulations, you guys. Our fourth consecutive national championship. Way to go, girls. The select team did its job. You pushed the junior elite competition team to the next level. And now they've pushed you right out the door. Goodbye. Our team beat the junior elites three times. We should not be the ones leaving. Who do I take to LA? I only want the girls that want this. I can make you a star or I can cut you. The group routine takes place in a hospital waiting room. We have done 
amazingly well with our group routines at nationals. Undefeated. We want this season to top every other season. So imagine if your family, your loved ones, were brought in by ambulance from a car accident. So imagine waiting to hear the news. Is it happy news? Or is it the worst humanly possible news? All right, do it again for me. The group number, it's more than a dance routine. I would call it a piece. There's an emotional range. There's interaction between the dancers. Maddie is playing our lead. It's heavy. Can she pull it off? Let's hope so, because she's the only choice I have. I need to see a lot more emotion from everyone. I think it looks crazy good. But let's face it, the emotion needs work. I want the judges to feel something. I want people to be on the edge of their seats. So Maddie, let's see what you have. Let's see what emotion you're gonna give me. Can I say something? Do you remember when you found out the first person you ever knew died, what you did? Yeah. This is Miller. Think about it. That's what you have to do. You have to, that's what actors do. They go back to some time in their life, and that's, that's what makes them cry, not the lines that they're saying right then and there. We've been through so much this season. But you know what? I have faith in them 100%. They're focused right now. They can do this. Nationals is finally here. So much is riding on this week's group dance. The LA team has won Nationals several years in a row. So I want our girls to do their absolute best. Come on, guys. This is it. Season five, it's been a rocky road. But we go out there, we do what the Abby Lee Dance Company is known for. That's coming to Nationals and winning. All right, let's go. Please welcome in his fall group, the Lady Group. It was so moving. I had goosebumps. There's people behind me in tears, crying. All righty. In our overall small group category, in second place, the waiting room, Abby Lee Dance Company. Okay, we, we, I'm sorry. But girls, we need to walk out. I'm done. It's embarrassing. I was just shocked. We can't win all the time, but I thought we definitely should have won with this one. Let's go. Go that way. You can't do it. Yes, they can. It's yeah. illegal. You can't hold children against their will in the state of California. I think Abby's lost her mind. Again. This week, we're attending nationals at Starbound. Yay, we like Starbound. The name of the routine is, Is There Still Hope? I need to do a number that leaves people feeling something at the end. Cancer. We did a cancer number. We did a group living, living with the ribbon. We did the ribbon. That was not. That was cancer. Was we did a ribbon of pink. Yes. What can't do this? I'm more creative than that. I'm better than that. And I just, if this is our last Nationals, what was the last story that you want people to hear? What do you want your legacy to be? All right. 
So on the group routine, I'm gonna go dark. Nia's gonna get shot. She's in a gang. Kalani is a drug addict. She's gonna OD. Bryn has an eating disorder. Kendall is schizophrenia and Cameron is a lady of the evening. I don't want to repeat myself over and over. No, we are going out with a bang. The group is called, Is There Still Hope? All of these things are possibilities at their age. And as the routine goes on, each character passes on. Kalani, you start to shake right there. Right, your whole body, your whole body. The drug was bad, it was bad. Oh my gosh, Kalani has to do convulsions on the floor. Oh. Wow. That was gruesome. That was gruesome. Hi! 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 This is it. I want a team that will go down in history as the team that couldn't be beat. All right, girls, let's run it. I want people to see that these girls can act. They can handle heavier material. I think there's a lot more in store for the girls. Is there more in store for me? Well, <laughs> TBD. This is a powerful platform to have to send your messages in an artistic format. This might be the last time you get to do this. This has been our best season ever. We've lost only once. All right, girls, this is it. I'm talking about it. Two weeks till nationals. One week till nationals. We're here. Remember the choreography? Feel the music and play your character. No regrets on the stage. None. All right, here we go with our next group from Candy Apples Dance Center, Abduction. Kathy beat us at nationals. It can't end with a loss. And now the Mabby Lee Dance Company is there still hope. goes down in history as winning nationals. These kids are incredible. They are my life. They're my kids, they're like my own kids. And sometimes I feel like that's all I have. We did it! You, Abby, you did it. We won! We did it and we couldn't have done it without you. Thank so you. Thank, thank you for you. sticking around. You know, this is your team, this is your legacy. I love you. <laughs> no, this is... Doesn't have to be the end of the journey, just a new chapter. I've never been so in love with my team before. <laughs> so your nationals this weekend, it's fearless dance competition. And all I care about, you guys, this week is winning. The group number is gonna be called Survivor. I love it. It's gonna be a contemporary piece, but I am putting in a ballroom influence. Oh, interesting. You know, dancing is my world, but there's a certain type of dancing that's my world, and this is my world. If it's if it sucks, then I look like a horrible teacher. The girls are gonna be doing salsa, ballroom infused, Latin style dancing. I don't know how to do any ballroom dancing. Like, and we're going into nationals. Probably not the best week to try a new style of dance. Let's go. Survival of the fist, come on. 
I think this week is a big eye opener. Yes, it's nationals. We want the kids to go out. We want them to dance. We want them to win. But I think that more than anything, we wanted to prove that we could win without Abby. Mm -hmm. This might be the last time some of those kids ever compete on stage again. Mm. Five, six, seven, eight. One, a two, three, a four, five, six, sharp, stop. You guys are not on a straight line. One, two, a three, four, five. Do it again. Kalani, you missed the count. You're the point, so just know it, OK? Do it again. I'm just in struggle city right now. Five, my ankle is killing me, so I have to really focus and put my game face on, because we have nationals tomorrow, and we cannot lose. Straighten your arms, Kendall. Watch your lines. You know, girls, like, I know I'm picky right now, but it just looks so sloppy. People are doing their own version of what this dance is. We have to dance in unison. It's nationals. Win or lose, I want you guys to feel that you gave it your all. It's weird to walk into competition and know that this could be the last time they ever compete on stage. This is really the end of this incredible journey for us. This is nationals. There's no other way to do this but full out times 100. I want you guys to be the best versions of yourself, each and every single one of you. I really do. Here we are on the West Coast. Abby has left us. And you know what? These kids worked really hard. This is their last dance. This is what people are going to remember them by. At the end of their dance, just hold it up really loud. Stand up, jump up. Oh, my God. Why do I have they need you backstage right away. Wait, what's going on? Her nose is so Oh, God, Chloe, Jesus. Put, put something cold on your neck. Put that cold water bottle. Yeah, is there, a, is there an ice pack? Oh, my God. Why did Chloe choose right now to spontaneously bleed? Can I have that? Clearly, she's feeling the pressure. Are you okay? Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Okay, so just. The show must go on. Ladies and gentlemen, please give it up for Survivor. <laughs> of the day. This is nationals. This is our last chance to win. There's no next week win now. Or go home losers. Our top overall of the day goes to, drum roll please. Number 54, Survivor. Irreplaceables are the West Coast national champs. Abby couldn't do that. They were able to achieve the West Coast national win. Cheryl, we have so much to thank you for. To see all of these girls on stage today dancing at that level with that conviction, it was like we had our old daughters back. OK, I love you guys. Don't suck. Don't suck. <laughs> I love you guys. No, don't take me back. I love you. I wanted to start all over with the new team because people doubted me. And I want to prove them wrong. And I'm doing it. I want you to be national champions. If you don't win the nationals, nothing else matters. That is going to be me proving all those naysayers out there wrong. This week, we're attending Fierce Dance Challenge in New York City. This week's group number is straight from the smash Broadway hit, The Prom. 
We're going to New York City for nationals, and the group dance this week is about the musical The Prom. And this is the first ever musical theater dance that the ALDC has done at nationals. So hopefully we win with it. Well, I mean, we have to win with it. The story is about two young girls who are in love with each other that just want to go to the prom together. Giannina, step forward. Hannah, step forward. You two will be playing the lesbians that want to go to the prom together. These two dancers have the most musical theater experience in the ALDC right now. Giannina and Hannah have to sell this story. If these two are like wimps out there, the loss will be on their shoulders. Jump up, swing around, and you're like, ah, ah. Right, but the problem is you can't look at the floor, and that's what you're doing. I need there to be this connection between the two of you, and you should be like glaring into her eyes. There's like all these emotions going on, stirring between the two of you, and I don't see any of that happening. Doing musical theater, in the biggest city in the world that's known Four. for Broadway and musical theater. This is a huge risk. Everyone there is going to be an expert at watching that type Wait, of dance. The judges are probably Broadway veterans. They have to be perfect if they're going to do that. Everyone knows contemporary lyrical, that's what we expect to win. But we're going to New York City with musical theater. Not only might we not win, we might leave embarrassed. All right, the next time we see these numbers, they will be on the stage at Nationals in New York City. Tomorrow, by this time, you will either be national champions or you won't. Don't blow your shot. Next up, the pro. <laughs> this is it. The entire season comes down to this group dance. Giannina and Hannah have to convey the story to the audience. And if they're not in love, nobody's going to get what it's about. Hopefully, with this routine, we can continue the legacy that I built here at the ALDC. dance floor. amazing and I don't think we could have done anything better and I just think we really told the story. I hope that the judges felt it and liked it. <laughs> the highest scoring national champion. The Prom! We did it! We won at nationals. We did it. I did it. I feel victorious. I feel like I still have something to give to these children. The ALDC is here to stay. And tell us all, where do you dance? 